Hi, it's Kana. Welcome back to my closet. Today I am doing the wish list tag. I was tagged by Jessica Lee, my friend here on YouTube. She's awesome. You should check her out. She does like a million panning videos and she's actually good at it, unlike me. So <laughs> I recommend you check her out. Um, and she's just also a sweetheart. So there's that. So this tag was actually created by Drea CN. So I will have both of their information linked down below. But let's get started because this is my kind of tag because I love a wish list. <laughs> it's all about buying things and that's apparently my favorite thing to do. So well, let me just start with question number one, which is, I have my list here. What is the very next makeup item you're planning on buying? Okay, well this is so easy. I am going to the Sephora Rouge event tomorrow and it's like this kind of early access deal to one, at least one of the palettes from the NARS collection, the holiday collection that's coming out and I am obsessed. So the palette is a face palette and it's got the classics in it, you know, um, it's the Orgasm Blush and the um, Laguna Bronzer and then I can't remember the highlighter that's in there. so. It's one of those and it is called the Orgasm Infatuation Face Palette and I I need everything from that line, but we're gonna start with that. So <laughs> I'm definitely buying that tomorrow at the event. I'm getting up at the crack of dawn and I am buying that palette because I need it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Jessica. I need it. <laughs> okay, I will insert a picture if I can find one of the packaging, of the product, so that you can see why I am so obsessed with it. But anyway, yes, the NARS Orgasm Infatuation Face Palette from the Holiday Collection will be mine tomorrow, yeah. Okay, two, question number two. If you could walk into Sephora today and buy any one item, regardless of budget, what would it be? Honestly, at this very moment right now, I am really loving the Natasha, I can't, why can't I say her name? The Natasha Denona Safari palette. It's beautiful. I really like that matte formula and I love that it's all mattes and they're flipping beautiful mattes and I really want that palette. Like I really do, but it's $129. I have 50 eyeshadow palettes. It just doesn't make any sense. So I've decided not to pick it up. But if I could just walk in and pick up like any one item right this moment, it would be the Natasha Denona Safari palette. It would. Yeah. <laughs> okay, number three. What is the oldest item on your Sephora loves list? Okay, that's kind of funny because I kind of have it right here, but. The oldest item on my Sephora loves list, and I know this without looking at it because I see it all the time, is J'adore Dior perfume. Like, not the sample, but the big bottle. So that is my oldest item on there. I just haven't sprung for it, but it's kind of like my husband's favorite scent on me. So I might have to get that, but it's the oldest item on my wish list. It's the one that never leaves. Like I'll take stuff off and put stuff on and buy stuff and remove it and just decide I don't want stuff and remove it. And this has always been there. So. J'adore Dior. Number four, what is the newest item on your Sephora loves list? I don't even know. Let's find out, shall we? What is the newest item? Okay, well that actually makes a lot of sense. Back to the questions. Okay. What perfume is on the top of your wish list? So 
as of right now, the perfume that I actually really want the most is all of the new Penrose perfumes. Like they have this like whole collection of like every color of the rainbow and I could not tell you which one. They're so good. Like I just sat there and smelled all of them and I'm dying. I want them all. They're so beautiful. But yes, at Sephora they have like all of them and I have smelled them all and I just, I need to get some samples of those tomorrow. They're so good. So probably the Pinrose perfumes and um, I can't name them all, but there's like a little kit that I might get that has like little roller balls of all of them. And I hate roller balls, but I can pop out the little top and put them in an atomizer. So I might do that. So there's that. Okay. Number six, what is the new release you're looking most forward to? We're going to do this again. <laughs> The new release I'm looking most forward to is everything from the NARS Holiday Collection. Almost everything. Seriously. It's so beautiful. So probably, probably like there's liquid lipsticks. I won't buy those. If there's like, there's some little kits that have like the little mini blush and the little mini like lipstick and stuff. And I probably won't buy those probably, but everything else I'm obsessed. Like that's what I'm looking forward to the most. It is my aesthetic. It's beautiful. I really want pretty much all of it. And you saw the picture of one of them. So, um, yeah, let me just, let's just, uh, Let's go into Instagram and see if I can show you why. So let's go to the saved folder and we'll pop up the new releases. Okay. Hi. So I don't know if you can see this. Yes, you can, but do you see this? This is the advent calendar. How flippin' cute is that? All the little spikes. It's so cute. So there's that. Oh God, here's all the face palettes. Obsessed. Do you see those? Let me see if you can focus in on these. Ugh, look at them. So beautiful. Okay, so the little kits with the lipsticks and the highlighters and the blush, the little minis. I don't even know if I care about what's inside, but look at the containers. Look at the packaging. Oh my God. It's so cute. I just need that to put things in. <laughs> I'm horrible. Oh, okay. Do you see this? No, not the packaging. The lipsticks are studded. Yes. And there's a black one. No, it's plum. It's like a deep, deep plum, but it's almost black. It's like a purple black. Even the makeup bag is adorable. I don't have a picture of that one, but it's red. It has black safety pins all over it. If you guys know me, you remember, like I haven't worn them in a while because I stretched up and I can't put them in here because I lose them. So I need to find a way to, to be able to stick them in here and not lose them. But um, I have these black safety pin earrings that I used to wear like constantly and I still love them. I just have to figure it out. But anyway, you know how I feel about that. So, yeah. So yes, that, that's what I need. That's what I'm looking forward to the most. You can see I'm very excited. I don't care about anything else. I'm saving all my holiday spending money for the NARS collection. It's amazing. So yes, I need it. That's, that's what, that's what I'm buying. Okay. Number seven, are there any drugstore products you want, but haven't pulled the trigger on? Um, no, <laughs> I'm sorry. I just, it's a funny question. Cause like if I want a two ninety nine highlighter or a four ninety nine blush or something from wet and wild or essence or whatever, I'll just buy it. It's not a big deal. Um, I'm sure there's other reasons that people might not 
want to do that. But no, there's no drugstore item I haven't pulled the trigger on. I would totally just buy it because it's just so easy to buy things that are that low of a cost for me when I can justify to myself buying like all this NARS crap. <laughs> you know, I'm not going to deny myself like a $5 blush. So if I want it, I'll buy it. So no, no to that. Okay, number eight, the eyeshadow palette you're lusting over the most. Let me think about that. No, I think I'm just going to have to go with the Natasha Denona one again, because that's really the only one that I think that I want right now. I guess there's your answer. Kind of weird. Some of these questions seem to like circle back to a different question because I'm going to have repeat answers, but there's that. Okay. Questions. Yeah. <laughs> okay. This is interesting. Question number nine. It says a product you're waiting for your next birthday, which is next week. Yeah. I don't even know anymore. But yeah, a product you're waiting for your next birthday or Christmas to ask for. I'm not. I don't ask for products. I just buy them. I don't get gifts. I just buy them for myself. Um, I don't ask my family to get me things like that because they're expensive. And... Um, I don't know. I just, I don't. And my husband, I wouldn't ask him anyway, because he'll just tell, if I ever ask him anything, he goes, okay, just buy it. So <laughs> I can't really, it was like, I was like, I want this for my birthday. He's like, all right, then buy it. So it's really just me buying it for myself. I don't have to wait. I've already gotten it. What did he buy me? It might've been my camera. I think it was my camera. Yeah. I asked for a new camera for my birthday. And he was like, okay, so order it. <laughs> so that's, that's what happened. That's how it goes around here. Um, we don't have surprises. We don't have gift exchanges. We just, if we want something, we buy it. We're not really even holiday people. So for my birthday, I'll probably get dinner out and a card and the camera that I'm talking to you on. So that's pretty much it. Yeah, we just don't do that around here. It's just not our way. So number 10, what is the item that you're dying to have that is not available in your country or area? There is nothing. There's probably stuff out there that I don't know about, but as far as I'm concerned, being in America, I'm pretty lucky in that I can kind of just get whatever I want. I mean, there's nothing that I want that's not here that would be impossible to get that I'm aware of. So nothing. Uh, let's see. 11. What is the thing that you really want, but you'll never buy because it's too expensive? Didn't we just cover this? The Natasha Denona Safari palette, the Natasha Denona Safari palette, the Natasha Denona one again. Okay. The last question, number 12. If there was a beauty product genie who could grant you one wish, what would you wish for? Okay. Yeah, I think I know this. So I would wish for the most perfect lineup of skincare. So like, the best skincare possible based on my exact skin and preferably in like one bottle. <laughs> so I didn't have to do the homework. I didn't have to test stuff out. I didn't have to like research everything. I didn't have to do any of that. There was just a bottle, you know, let's just say like there was just like a skincare bottle that just had my name on it. it just says Kana and it worked perfectly and just took care of all of my skincare issues. Yeah. Pr 
probably that would be the best thing because honestly, in my opinion, I think the best makeup is good skin. Yeah, that's what I would want. Awesome skin all the time. And in a product that I could just use one thing and it would be super convenient and it would never be like, oh, there's like 12 things I have to put on my face before I go to bed. Nah, I ain't gonna do it. I do that sometimes and it's terrible. But yeah, that's what I would want to make that easy. Just dial it in, solve all my skincare problems, solve all of my skin issues, call it good. That would be my wish. So anyway, uh, that is going to be everything. I don't know who did she tag. I know she tagged me. <laughs> or Lisa Jen. Okay. So Jessica tagged me and now I get to tag some people. So I'm going to tag, I'm going to tag Alexi. I tag you. And I'm going to tag RD Lover Bunny, Rania. And I'll tag Rachel. So Rachel Winners, you. I'm tagging you. But also, I think I'm curious to see... I'm kind of curious to see what Paula would say. So a beauty guru made me do it. So Paula, I'm tagging you. I don't know if you guys have done this or not because I haven't I haven't seen it and you're in my feed so I'm assuming not unless I just forgot because I'm a space cadet so there is that so yeah that's gonna be everything for me and I'm gonna go ahead and start on my wish list check off process tomorrow morning when I go get that little NARS palette so yeah <laughs> anyways y'all know that you're tagged so you can do this if you want to. I'm real curious to see what everybody says. I'm so nosy. I love a good collection video and a wish list video is also amazing. So I would love to hear what y'all have to say. And if you have not been tagged by name, consider yourself tagged because I would love to hear it. Um, I'm just nosy like that. So if you want to do the tag, do it and let me know in the comments below that you're doing it so I can go watch you. That is everything. And yeah, until next time. Bye.